Earlier, in 2022, when photographs from NASA's biggest, most potent space telescope were made public, U.S. Senator Marco Rubio shared one of them on Twitter along with a scripture from the Bible, the heavens declare the glory of God. The Webb telescope is roughly 2 million kilometers from Earth as it orbits the sun. The observatory is utilizing incredibly sensitive infrared cameras to find the first galaxies in the universe. The first pictures made public offered the first ever view of old galaxies illuminating the sky. James Webb Space Telescope is regarded as the next chapter in space-based telescope astronomy and is the much-awaited and considerably larger successor to the Hubble Space Telescope, which is now having difficulty continuing to operate in low Earth orbit. The James Webb includes an array of mirrors with a collective diameter almost three times greater than that of the Hubble Space which results in approximately seven times more light gathering capacity than Hubble. Hubble has a single primary mirror. This enables the James Webb to look much farther into space than any other telescope by allowing it to collect more light from far off objects in the cosmos. We have studied the sky from the beginning of time in an effort to comprehend the scope of God's creation. Most of us are likely familiar with the statement that said, I believe in the Big Bang Theory, God said it, and bang, it happened. Further proof of God's intelligence and strength in the creation of the sun, moon, and stars, as well as the sky and the earth, can be seen in the photographs taken by the Webb Telescope. The Webb Telescope showed a larger sample of early galaxies, giving researchers a better understanding of how galaxies form. Additionally, it helped provide a clearer image of the reionization process, which enabled particles to combine to create the components required for the creation of stars and galaxies. The combination of these factors points to an amazing blending of chaos and design. The data acquired by the Webb telescope is startling in that it indicates more design and less chaos than anticipated, highlighting a strange equilibrium between these two forces. We are aware that some may initially feel that everything presented here violates biblical inerrancy and runs counter to the widely accepted theory of biblical cosmology. It's not true, though. The theological notion of a God who created the cosmos by the power of his word is supported by the data gathered by the Webb telescope, the study done, and the information evaluated. Furthermore, it is evident that the chaotic, random creation model put forth by atheists cannot be used to refute God, and the reasons put out by supporters of design theories do not properly fit the data. The images of red flecked galaxies, glittering nebulas, and star clusters serve as a reminder of the handiwork of a God who has made his splendor visible above for us to see as we gaze at his heavens and behold the creation of his fingers. The Eagle Nebula was one of the most notable objects seen in photographs taken by the Hubble Telescope. An object in this planetary nebula is known as the Pillars of Creation. Three dust pillars that resemble an earthly landscape are seen in this photograph, lighted by nascent stars. The photographs of this nebula is taken by the James Webb Telescope. There must be more to our universe than what we can currently see. Therefore, it would appear that although God gave mankind the knowledge of eternity in their hearts, he did not give them the capacity to understand what and how God had done this from the beginning to the end of creation. The fact is that one everlasting God used his unending creative abilities to build this wonderful universe. This is beyond our capacity to understand, nor are we intended to. We would be God if we could understand such vast brilliance. The sky above announces God's creation, and the heavens declare his grandeur. Speech flows from day to day, while wisdom emerges from night to night. There is no speech or word whose voice is not heard. Their words travel to every corner of the globe, and their voice fills the entire earth. Black holes interiors are unknown to science. The Webb telescope it has only been able to learn about their matter composition and surface level properties. The James Webb Space Telescope is expected to be able to solve the information paradox, according to scientists. 
Through infrared light, James Webb Space Telescope can see objects. The dusty nebula or cloud of dust won't be able to obstruct infrared light's field of vision while exploring the universe because it can travel far and pass through solid objects. The black hole myth was dispelled by the 2017 publication of a photograph of one. One of the hotter regions of the cosmos is a black hole, which does not spaghettify the matter it absorbs, but instead emits particles continuously from within. However, there are many ifs and buts, such as the fact that only 5% of ordinary matter is capable of producing 27% of dark matter and 67% of dark energy. Thus, the non-existence of God will be demonstrated if James Webb is able to trace the beginning of the 13.7 billion light-year cosmos. On the other side, James Webb might be crucial in the search for gods, but we believe there will be more proof of the universe's creation in the future. We shall discover scientific evidence that will clarify how God fascinatingly used design and chaos to create the universe. And we will concur with the psalmist in proclaiming how God's beauty is evident in the skies and his power is made known throughout creation as we take in the breathtaking views produced by the telescope. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating space-related content. As always, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.